Welcome to Rex Pines TV. I'm Danielle Santiago. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Friday, May 15th, 2020. Let's go to Mr. Rodoni. Good morning, Patriots. Good morning, everyone. This is Mr. Bardoni and Eiko. And Hi. today is Friday. What are we doing on Fridays? Thank you notes every Friday. Good. We're doing thank you notes. So, Eiko, let's begin with our thank you notes. Okay. Thank you, Miss Anaya, Miss Rivas, Miss Campbell, Miss Coronado, Miss Morales, Miss Cherizel, for all your hard work. And I am very proud to be part of this great family. You ladies rock. Miss Irazo. Thank you, Miss Garner, for all your hard work that you've put in forth since the start of this virtual learning journey. You are a rock star, Miss Cavalita. Thank you, Miss Rosa, for always inspiring. I am so thankful to be working with you, Miss Kuttner. Thank you to all my scholars for joining me on my Zoom meetings each week. Seeing your faces and hearing your voices always brings joy, especially on the tougher days. You are my sunshine. I love you all. Miss Miguel. Thank you, Miss Velez, for everything that you do for your team. You're always willing to share and help implement new things. Miss Milholm. Thank you, Ms. Carter, for your consistency and hard work. Happy birthday, Ms. Milholm. Happy birthday. Thank you, Ms. Julian, for your support and encouragement. I appreciate you always being available to answer a million of my questions and for your willingness to always lend a helping hand, Ms. June. Thank you, Ms. Hendrickson, for everything you do for your team. Ms. Milholm. Thank you, Ms. Joyce Stringer, for your support through my first year of teaching. Even though it's not my first teaching, I've learned so much from you. I appreciate you, Ms. Cohen. Thank you, Kenneth Santiago, my super kid, for always putting forth maximum effort. Your determination is going to get you far. Miss Barnes. Thank you, Camila Calmenares, for always being a positive force in ELA Zoom meetings. Miss Brown. Thank you, Gabriela Hernandez, for staying on top of your online work, checking in, and encouraging your classmates to do their assignments. Love you lots, Miss Moraes. Thank you, Christian Rodriguez, Miguel Fernandez, and Aaron Silvera Silva Portal for always doing the right thing and having pride in your work. I appreciate seeing your faces on Zoom and I'm proud of your perseverance, Miss Dry. Thank you, Jordan Edwards and Jada Sinclair for never missing a Zoom meeting 
for your hard work and your dedication. I am super proud of you. Keep up the great work, Miss Merkel. Thank you, Coach Lee and Miss Hendrickson for motivating me and being part of the Mile A Day Club, Miss Tucker. Thank you, Miss Milholm, for all your positive reinforcement and encouragement to your team, even though you are going through hard times. We really appreciate you. It's really a sign of your true leadership. Thank you for all you do, Miss Milholm. Love you, love you lots. We both do. Mm -hmm. With that, we want to say have a fabulous Friday. Okay, enjoy the weekend. Relax, and we'll see you next week. Thank you, Parent Church, if you're watching this. Bye. Bye. Thank you, Mr. Redoni. That was awesome. Now let's go to Jaden to see what's happening today in history. Thank you, Daniel. Today in history, on May 15th, 1940, the first McDonald's fast food restaurant opened. Maurice and Richard McDonald's opened McDonald's Barbecue in San Bernardo. Today, McDonald's is the world's largest fast food chain. Now let's go to Nathaniel to see what they do today if you're bored and stuck indoors. Thank you, Jaden. Hello, Patriots family. Welcome to Things to Do If You're Bored. For today's activity, we're going to make a turtley red paper plate turtle. This is what it looks like. Here are the steps. Take two brown sheets of paper, a paper plate, make sure there's two, and then two googly eyes. Then grab some markers to decorate, and I'm using a pencil to make sure I get the measurements right and also get some scissors. So first fold your paper into three. Then cut along the lines. After that, trim it down so that it's the right size. Then take your paper and cut out the shape of a paper plate. Then glue it over the paper plate. After that, cut out a little piece of the paper plate so that the head can stick out. Then tape the sides of it so that it would stay correctly. Then cut out the back of the paper plate. Cut out a head and then glue your googly eyes on it. After that, glue it onto the tail. Then stick it through. Take the pieces that you cut off and tape them back onto it so that it will stay in the right spot. Then write them out and decorate your turtle. Take your two strips that you used and then put them on the back of your turtle so that you can walk. Decorate the back of your turtle and color it in with markers or pencils or any other thing. Then you have your turtle. Wow! Wasn't that awesome? Now you have something great to play with. A special thanks to our scars that submitted their crafts. Jaden, Maya, and Chanel. Remember, if you do this DIY, send a picture or video to pines.renaissance at gmail.com. And don't forget to check in tomorrow for the next DIY. And stay creative. Now let's go back to Danielle. Thank you, Nathaniel. Now let's go to weather with Vani. Thank you, Danielle. Today's weather in Pembroke Pines, Florida is forecasted to be 77 degrees Fahrenheit and thunderstorms. Now, let's go back to Samuel for the joke of the day. 
Thank you, Bonnie. And here's today's joke of the day. There are two muffins in an oven. One muffin turns to the other muffin and says, Boy, it's hot in here. The other muffin says, Oh my goodness, a talking muffin. <laughs> now let's go back to Danielle. <laughs> Thank you, Sammy. That was hilarious. In admin announcements, Teachers, please be on your remote page to welcome your scholars in, in the morning. Attendance must be taken at some point each day. And lastly, teachers, please don't forget to, pro to provide our scholars with positive hero points. Patriots, don't forget your past expectations. It represents. Present yourself positively. Act kindly towards others. Treat the school's environment respectfully. And succeed at everything. Congrats, Ms. Milholm, Ms. Gilbert, Mr. Santiago, Ms. Anaya, Mrs. Santiago, Ms. Santori, and Mrs. Kuttner. You had the correct answer to yesterday's riddle, which was, if you're running in a race and you pass the person in second place, what place are you in? The correct answer to the riddle was second place. Now for today's riddle. What has many teeth but can't bite? Once again, what has many teeth but can't bite? Teachers, please send your answers to pinesarenaissance at gmail.com before 10 a.m. in order for your responses to be reviewed. Winners will be announced the following day. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you a fantastic Friday. And remember, reset your mindset. Have a great day.